In 50 minutes, Peter Brown concludes his Requiem for a Railway. Now on one, at a time when television's relationship with terrorism is again caught up in controversy, viewers and broadcasters join Anna Ford in tonight's network to exam examine whether the media is supplying terrorists with the oxygen of publicity. hijacking and the political row over the documentary on the SAS killings in Gibraltar, Network examines television's response to terrorism. Tonight a viewer claims that the demand for dramatic news pictures is supplying the oxygen of publicity to terrorists. But could fighting terrorism become an excuse for censorship? Welcome to Network, the series which gives you, the viewer, your chance to challenge television's producers and policy controllers about issues which concern you. For tonight's programme, we're in a studio at Pebble Mill in Birmingham, and we're joined by an audience from the West Midlands who've come to express their views on how television should respond to terrorism. But first, we're going to hear from Craig, just back from Australia, with some of the points raised in your letters and phone calls about recent BBC programmes. 